Well, this week in Springfield, the balloon popped. You've probably read or saw that or somehow or another that down here, we've taken a big step backward on our agreement to move forward toward a budget. So the story is very simple. We've got a couple of sides trying to work together. We've got a package that's all strung together as one unit. And one side said, we want to vo start voting on some parts. The other side said, no, this is all a string that's together. We don't want to vote on parts. And the side that wanted to vote on parts just went ahead. And quite frankly, they made a good bit of sport of us with questions like, if not now, when? Well, here's a suggestion. Maybe after all 13 bills are written. Because that's right, the 13th bill doesn't even exist yet. But yet we were expected to start voting. Uh, we heard all about the, uh, you can't vote on 13 things simultaneously. Well, I teach 17 year olds for a living that that kind of exaggeration is called extension. And it's a cheap argumentative trick because nobody was asking for 13 simultaneous votes. But hey, how about maybe all 13 on the same day? How about even all 13 in the same week? That's reasonable. And if we would have started voting on those four, we wouldn't have been able to finish all votes even in the same week. So as you hear all the finger pointing and so forth and so on that's going to go on about why this balloon popped, it seems to me pretty clear. If it's a unit, you vote on it as a unit. And if you're together, you vote on it when you're together. I could probably go on with this forever. So I'm just going to say that's this week's edition of Rooney's Roundup. You're always free to call or email the office here with any questions or concerns that you might have. We're always happy to hear what your take is on the things that you're hearing from Springfield.